Hey, good people. Happy Manic Minute Monday. My name's Michael Herman. I've never had hummus, but I tell people that I hate it. And this week we're talking about miniature things, dots, and rings. So without further ado, here we go. First up, Google Maps is officially done taking pictures of our world and has begun to take pictures of a miniature one. Calling the project the Miniature Wonderland, Google has completely documented the world's largest train set. A total of 900 trains and one Google car to explore. It's eight miles of track across a bunch of different rooms, and you can walk it at a miniature pedestrian level. Now you can see as the minifigure sees. You can be the meeple. They are beginning to get very bored at Google Maps. Up next is a goldsmith from North Carolina named Olga Schechtman. Actually, the first goldsmith I've ever talked about on this show. She's famous for taking iconic cityscapes and turning them into rings. Paris, San Francisco, Berlin, other city names. They're available in gold, silver, and platinum in a city of you, near you. Up next is an American jam band in Georgia called Perpetual Groove. And they are a perpetual groove. They're an indie electro rock band, but they also mix a bunch of their southern roots into their music. So if you're wondering what an indie electronic southern rock band sounds like, Link in the description. And finally, is an illustrator named Xavier Casolta who took pointillism to a whole new level with his illustration, Autumn. Everything in the picture is made of dots. No dashes, no colors, dots. This 23-year-old estimates that there are roughly seven million dots and nobody's going to count them to rival that. Woo, dramatic sigh, as if I said it all in one take. <laughs> Thanks for stopping by, guys. I really do appreciate that. If you want to like and subscribe, those buttons are down below. Press them. <laughs> Pretend that didn't sound weird. And I will see you next week on Monday. Now go, inspire your souls.